All right, let's let's do day two. Let's do it. Um, if you haven't done day two yet, spoilers abound. Uh, but I'm going in. This was your warning. All right, day two, cube conundrum. You're going to lurk? Okay. You're launched high into the atmosphere. The apex of your trajectory barely reaches the surface of a large island floating in the sky. You gently land on a fluffy, fluffy pile of leaves. It's quite cold, but you don't see much snow. An elf runs over to greet you. An elf explains that you've arrived at Snow Island and apologizes for the lack of snow. He'll be happy to explain the situation, but it's a bit of a walk, so you have some time. They don't get many visitors up here. Would you like to play a game in the meantime? As you walk, the elf shows you a small bag and some cubes, which are either red, green, or blue. Each time you play this game, you will hide a secret number of cubes of each color in the bag, and your goal is to figure out information about the number of cubes. Uh, hello, I think people are present, but they don't talk in chat because they're listening in the background. Yeah, no, I think the same thing. Uh, like, I don't actually, like, not believe the viewer count. I'm just saying, like, sometimes it, it feels a little bit... I don't know. It's, it's a mental thing, right? I <laughs> think. Uh, okay. So, to get information, once a bag has been loaded with cubes, the elf will reach into the bag, grab a handful of random cubes, show them to you, and then put them in the bag. He'll do this a few times per game. So we're, like, sampling the, uh, the number of cubes in the bag. You play several games and record the information from each game. Each game is listed with its ID number. Okay. Record of a few games might look like this. Three sets of cubes are revealed from the bag and then put back again. First set is three blue cubes and four red cubes. The elf would first like to know which games would have been possible. Oh, oh. Wait. Which ones would have been possible? Oh, shit. So basically, we need to look at the input and be like, okay, game three is impossible because there were 20 red cubes and since there's only 12 red cubes in the bag, he couldn't possibly have pulled out that many. Is that the only thing we have to consider? So we just need to like filter. Uh... So this would, this is considered, this whole row is considered one game. So game three would have been impossible. Game four would have been impossible. Right. So having one, one like round that's impossible invalidates the whole game, I guess. This is a big handful. He pulls out 34 cubes. <laughs> immersion broken <laughs> yeah i don't i don't think i can solve this problem because it's just not it's not immersive enough okay well this seems straightforward we need to oh this is 
So this is a little bit hard. Um, mm. Oh, this is a really, this is really a pain. This is very simple in other languages. Um, ah, oh, geez. How do I want to go about this? So let's see, we have some... This is essentially an input, right? All right, here, here's my idea, right? We, uh, we find, we find blue. And what's the, what's the blue number? So we have 14 blue cubes. Uh, well here, let's, let's just demonstrate. We can get rid of the word blue. And then we can replace it with greater than 14. So now it says three greater than 14. Yeah, no, this is good. Oh, this is dumb. All right, hang on. So let's do the same thing for red. What's the number for red? 12 and green is 13. Well, let's make those in the right order. There. So, okay. So game one, this, this is silly. This is a little bit silly. We got to trim off the, the game one, two, three, four, five thing. All right, let's, let's look at our output. Okay, so it is it is sequential like like games. Uh so we can we can uh let's go by spaces and it's gonna be field one, two okay, field three onwards. Gets rid of the the game garbage. And what we're gonna do is replace uh semicolon or a comma with a plus sign <laughs> and now if everything goes well we just go into bc it didn't work okay why doesn't that work i think we need parens around our uh our statements. Let's get a little capture group going. I don't I don't know if this is going to go well. Yeah, that that uh that does too much. What if we do uh not plus? Okay, that almost worked. Okay, move this first. There we go. Um Oh wait, but the plus doesn't go inside. So we need like this. How do we get the last one? We maybe we should just do this better. Um, actually say what we mean. Uh, okay. Let's, let's get a, let's get rid of the spaces. So like that, there we go. So let's change this side to say, hmm. It's it's a set of numbers 
Okay, zero to nine star greater than. Does your use of bash require that you use a single pipeline for everything? I mean, we gotta we gotta make it go fast, right? Uh, there we go. Okay, let's put this into BC. Hey, okay, look at this. So games four and five are invalid because they they have because they're not zero basically. So we need to do uh. We need the line numbers, so we can get the line numbers back. No problem. Now, I think we want to do a TRS. No? Oh, I'm missing a, I'm missing a slash. What? Is this a tab? Bash grep for tab. Pearl style? Dollar before single quotes? There we go. Okay. Then we get rid of the zero with a good old cut. Uh, F1. Uh... And then we can do our classic pastes, which gives us uh, 1 plus 2 plus 5. And then we go into BC again. We get 8. Is 8 the right answer for the sample? Yeah. All right. Let's, uh, let's do the full input. Okay, 2164. Do we get it? Let's go. All right. Um that's a commit. Okay, continue to part 2. The elf says that they've stopped producing snow because they aren't getting any water. He isn't sure why the water stopped. However, he can show you how to get the water source to check it for yourself. It's just up ahead. As you continue your walk, the elf poses a second question. In each game you played, what is the fewest number of cubes of each color that could have been in the bag to make that game possible? Oh no. Not like this. So, so we're looking for we're looking for the Basically, the biggest number in each row for each color. Because we're going to come up with three three numbers for each game. And then what do we, what do we have to do? I'm sorry. The, the power of a set of cubes is equal to the number of red, green, and blue cubes multiplied together. Sure. The power of the minimum set of cubes in game one is 48. Uh, adding up these... Okay. Christ. Uh, this is this this is harder. This, this is harder, admittedly. I think we're going to have to split a game into multiple lines for this to work. Okay. We have a uh, we've reinvented cat in a much less efficient form. Okay. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to cut d uh space
F uh two F two onwards. Let's go. Let's go F three onwards. Sure, why not? Um. What are we doing here? This is our this thingy. Oh no. Uh we get rid of the space? There we go. And now we do sort n uh reverse. And now we got to do something cool that I forget how to do. Yes, we can we can tell unique to skip the first n fields. So we can pass a we can say unique uh f2 Did that work? I don't think that worked. Skip fields. So we should get um can we can we put like a blank line or something in between these? Oh wait, shoot. No, that doesn't work. Because it's not sorted by wait, does it work? Red, green, blue. No, because this one says blue, red, blue. Okay, I've got a really bad solution. <laughs> Which I like the sound of. So we have this, this sorted list. We can preserve the ranks by doing a cat dash n. Um we're gonna resort it by uh lexicographically by the fields. Three K three? Yes. <laughs> oh god, what have I done? This is horrible. Okay. Now we can run unique on uh fields skip two. And we'll get blue, green, red for all of them. Um does that mean we don't even need this garbage? Hold up. What happens if we get rid of this? We replace this with two and this with one. And now we just cut... Uh, Field one, paste SD star. Were these the numbers? 48, 12, 15, 60, 630, 36, respectively. What have we done? I have a number. I'm just going to submit it. <laughs> First try. God, what a what a ride. What a rush. <laughs> 